KillerGuitarSchool.com, and you are here for the first Quick Hit Vid. And what the Quick Hit Vid thing is like, it, the idea is, you know, you get all your fundamental stuff in some, in, the, in some of the other videos, and here you come here for just something that's like quick and like, okay, try this and go off and play with that and make it your own. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you is in that little bunch of stuff that I did, you know, just kind of noodling and, you know, you know, jacking around, I did a, a little run, and it sounds like this. You know, it's just yeah. Okay, that's an A minor seven arpeggio. Now you can move that around to all the other keys, whatever key you want. But the idea is, it's a really neat kind of cool way to get from the low parts of the neck to the high parts of the neck, and and you know have it be something more than just you know going step by step up a scale. Which one will take you a little bit longer, and two might not sound quite as cool unless you know unless you're really good at that. And you, you might prefer it, you might not. Anyway, so here's how I do this lick. Okay? It's an A minor seven arpeggio and it's gonna be a just straight A minor for a little while. So you're gonna take your middle finger on the uh, on your left hand and you're gonna start on the fifth fret of the low E string which is A. Makes sense, right? And you're gonna go and this A is almost like it's like a glitz. It's ghosted in it. It's not really emphasized. So it's and you're gonna slide that middle finger up to the uh, eighth fret, and that's C. So it's A C, and then you're gonna you're gonna sweep pick if you want to call it that the uh, the seventh fret of the A and the D string. So you're going like that, okay? And this is A. I mean, this is E, and this is A right there. So what you've got now. You've got a little A minor arpeggio, so it's okay. Now you'll notice my my ring finger, my third finger, came in and got the tenth fret of the D string. So it's now I'm switching positions, and my first finger comes in on the ninth fret of the G string. Okay, so okay. Now my middle finger is on the tenth fret of the A string. Now we're, I'm, what I'm doing is I'm, I'm building it and going to the next note each time. So it's right there. That's where we are now, right? So I slid. See the middle finger was here on, on the 10th fret of the A string. Middle, slide, still middle. One, one, three, one, two, slide, still two, and then one on the twelfth fret of the uh, of the high E. By the way, this is the thirteenth fret of the B. In case I didn't catch that, so it's and then third finger here. If you want to bend it up, or I, I'll take my middle finger on the uh, major sixth of the scale and bend that up to the minor seventh to kind of emphasize that seven. Yeah. The lick. Uh, let's get up close and personal on that one, okay? Alright, so take a look at this. Starting with my middle finger here on the uh, on the low E string fifth fret. seen the lick all right and um, hopefully you know it comes across easy 
and go off, play with that a little bit, have a good time, and uh, see you for the next quick hit bid.